सलाम नमस्ते सस्वीकाल आदाब और याली मदद मैं हूं आपका होस्ट अकबर हेराव और आप देख रहे हैं सलाम नमस्ते कैनेडा टीवी प्रोग्राम ऑन चकडे टीवी दोस्तों पिछले दिनों मैं किताब पढ़ रहा था और उस किताब के अंदर राइटर ने बहुत अच्छी बात कही जो मैं आपके साथ शेयर करना चाहता हूं उसने कहा कि अगर कोई आपको एक बिलियन डॉलर दे तो क्या आप उसे अपनी आँखें दे देंगे क्या अपने हाथ दे देंगे उसे या फिर अगर वो आपसे आपके पैर मांगे तो क्या आप उन्हें अपने पैरों को दे देंगे दोस्तों हमेशा हम गिला करते हैं शिकवा करते हैं अपने इर्द गिर्द ना होने का हर एक को एहसास दिलाते हैं लेकिन सिर्फ अपनी जिंदगी में अगर हम अपने आप को देखें अपने इर्द गिर्द नमतों को देखें तो हमें पता चलेगा कि खुदाविंद ताला ने भगवान ने हमें कितनी सारी नमतों से नवाजा है जिन्हें हम इग्नोर करते हैं तो दोस्तों इस अच्छे मैसेज के साथ आज के इस प्रोग्राम की शुरुआत करेंगे कि अपने इर्द गिर्द और अपनी जिंदगी में जो आपको ब्लेसिंग्स मिली हैं उसको चेरिश कीजिए उसके लिए थैंकफुल रहिए और उसके लिए ग्रेटिट्यूड हमेशा अपने जिस भी भगवान को आप मानते हैं खुदा को मानते हैं उसे हमेशा थैंक्स कीजिए सो इस अच्छे नोट के ऊपर आज के इस प्रोग्राम की शुरुआत करते हैं मैं इंट्रोड्यूस कराना चाहूँगा आज के हमारे स्पेशल गेस्ट जिनका नाम रोहिणी सिंह है और इनके बारे में क्या कहूँ ये एक मल्टी टैलेंटेड आर्टिस्ट है मॉडल हैं और साथ ही साथ एक बहुत ही कामयाब प्रोफेशनल भी हैं उनको इंट्रोड्यूस करवाने से पहले मैं अपने को होस्ट जलाल लाडक को इंट्रोड्यूस करवाना चाहूँगा और आपके सामने इस प्रोग्राम के अंदर पेश करना चाहूँगा तो जलाल भाई कैसे हैं बस अकबर ठीक है बिल्कुल ठीक है अपना मेरी तरफ से भी आप सबको सलाम अकबर आपने बहुत ही अच्छी एग्जाम्पल दी कि यू नो जो अच्छे काम जो जो शुरू होते हैं वो हमारे जो अपना यानी कि हम खुद से शुरू होते हैं पहला काम बिल्कुल अगर आप अपने आप को ही पसंद नहीं करेंगे तो वो काम कैसे शुरू करेंगे अच्छा बिल्कुल और नेमतें तो हैं यू नो कि आप जैसे आप जो यानी कि आपके जो है चारों तरफ हैं आप किसी को जो है खुश कर दें वो भी एक नहमत है वो भी एक बंदगी है आप किसी की तारीफ कर दें वो भी अपना एक तरह की नहमत किसी बंदगी किसी के लिए और जो यानी और जो किसी को अपना खुश करना इसका मतलब है कि यानी कि आपने जो है ऊपर वाले को खुश कर दिया एब्सोल्युटली बहुत इसमें अच्छी बात है बहुत बड़ी बात है तो अगेन हमारा मैसेज हमेशा यही रहता है बिल्कुल कि आप अपने जो है यानी आपकी फैमिली आपके दोस्त उसको उसको हमेशा खुश रखिए उस उनको जो है हमेशा प्यार कीजिए तो देखें कि आपकी ये जिंदगी जो है जिंदगी कितने आराम से गुजरती है क्योंकि लाइक अगर दोस्तों ये बात जो जलाल भाई ने कही और हम लोग ये हमेशा इस बात को प्रमोट करते हैं चंदे चैनल के थ्रू कि लाइक जो नहीं है उसके ऊपर क्या गिला शिकवा करना बिल्कुल जो है उसकी कदर कीजिए बिल्कुल तो आज हमारे साथ रोहिणी सिंह मौजूद है आइए उनके साथ बातों का सिलसिला शुरू करते हैं सो रोहिणी वेलकम टू द शो थैंक यू इट्स ऑलवेज प्लेजर टू हैव यू लाइक आई थिंक लाइक हाउ मेनी टाइम्स यू एक्चुअली केम टू अवर रेडियो शो इट्स लाइक अ फैमिली नाउ सो बहुत अच्छा लग रहा है आप लोगों जब हमको बुलाते हैं तो फिर मुझे बहुत अच्छा Thank That's you. wonderful. <laughs> And this is not the first time you are on Chakda TV. No, the set is so familiar. <laughs> yeah, actually welcome home. <laughs> welcome home. <laughs> welcome back. It's been so long. <laughs> so like uh us जो आपका एक्सपीरियंस था चकते के साथ आप मेरे ख्याल से एक प्रोग्राम करती नहीं यहाँ से तो वाई वोट यू एक्चुअली टेल अस अबाउट दैट एंड प्लस योर बैकग्राउंड श्योर सो मैं चकते सिनेमा शो की होस्ट करती थी दो साल पहले एंड वी स्टार्ट ऑफ द शो जस्ट डूइंग मूवी रिव्यूज बॉलीवुड मूवी रिव्यूज हर हफ्ते अबाउट द डिफरेंट एक्टर्स एंड द डिरेक्टर्स एंड um the reviews of each movie that happened during the week and we also mixed in hollywood movies as well so that mm-hmm. was really fun mm-hmm. so i mean che mahino ke liye kya and i remember it start off with um sasrikal dosto main ruhini singh check the cinema the host or twadi dost twara is show vich swagat kar diya that's amazing <laughs> isn't it like so ruhini really, like uh, you are actually uh, related with media and mm-hmm. we have seen you like um, it's been now like years like we actually met you we actually mm-hmm. uh, saw your performances how this all started like <laughs> yeah uh, this is like where rohini yeah. singh actually started all these things mm. okay <laughs> well um for this i'm going to speak in english absolutely please <laughs> if you know punjabi you can just on punjabi too <laughs> so punjabi well i think i used to always 
be interested in dance. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, for, you know, whether it's classical, kathak, and then explored folk dancing, pangra folk dancing, mm -hmm. and then explored Bollywood. And now, mm -hmm. I mean, there's so many different styles of Bollywood. Yeah. And there's hip hop and belly dancing, and it's just, it's just a lot. It's a fusion. Yeah. Um, so alongside my studies, I used to keep dance as a hobby. Mm -hmm. And then when I was in, I think, fourth year university, um, I was doing a double degree. I was doing business and psychology. And then during my fourth year, I was just like, okay, I need to try acting. Yugi, um, I, I always loved it. I always wanted to try yeah. out how it felt to act. Absolutely. And um, when I was little, I was very shy. My priorities were different. I think a lot of people, you know, when they're going through school, when they're going through high school, mm -hmm. you don't really know who you are yet, and you try new things. Right. So in university, I finally said, okay, I'm going to do some acting. Okay. Then I did a lot of volunteering. Ki. Mm -hmm. Pele Pele volunteering kya for school me gay company of rogues acting school in Calgary. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um was, you know, I did some courses over there and then a agent mila or for agent kesa thora sa kaam karte karte hue thora sa commercials for thora sa short films. Fir maine kaha chalo theek hai main um ek pageant try karti hu. Okay. So yes. that's when I did the Miss India Canada pageant. Mm -hmm. And um I mean saath saath obviously kept up the dancing and um just for Miss India Canada it was it was a great experience. Bahut sari ladki log ke saath mila and um it was it was very good. It got to top 5. Wow, amazing. Yeah. Um, so that was it, was, it was good because, you know, there was only two people representing Western Canada. Mm -hmm. lots, of lo lots of girls are from, you know, Eastern Toronto Eastern, side okay. and everywhere. So that was a good experience. And then, bus, Facebook page, Vanadia, <laughs> 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 or um, a Aura opportunity, Mila, mm -hmm. with Bollywood star, Karni Kili. Yeah. And then from there on, I've just. That's just how it began. Wow. <laughs> and she's always there for us. Uh, this is, uh, you know, it's very helpful. Very, thank you. Thanks for that. Thank you. And like Rohini, like uh, she does a lot of charity work as well. Mm -hmm. Okay, or like our fundraising events, which are the World Partnership Work, you know, mm -hmm. friends, the Aga Khan Foundation, we do for them. Rohini, Deepak Mahana, like every kind of performer who performs there, they support us. Honestly, uh, mm -hmm. because of you guys, we generate a lot of funds for those people. For those events. Ke liye. So, thank you uh, to you guys. Oh, no, like, Deepak. you know, guys, you guys also <laughs> always supported us, and I think like uh, people like you, uh, the performers, right, uh, the sponsors are actually uh, the reason those events actually getting successful. Of course, of course. Yeah. Jalal bhai. Ji Rohini, so of course you know you've been doing acting, you know, that's your mm -hmm. field now. So if you acting, then what do you do now? Um, I, I just, I do want to say, pehle, um, mm. Deepak Mana, apne right. kya. No, he is such a phenomenal friend mm. and you know we've been dancing for I think over two years and yeah. mm. I just want to say that dancing with him is amazing because mm. his energy his positivity mm -hmm. and just like you said like thank you for creating these charity shows mm -hmm. so that we can also give back and then you guys get the kind of exposure yeah. as well yeah and you know it's, it's just nice it's it, your shows Aplagunka shows are very good or Hum jaise performance ko bhi achha lagta hai. That's amazing. Ko, That's amazing. Audience, you know, the audience is good. Of course, of course, of course. Yeah. Keep coming. Keep coming. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, back to your question. Haan, you, hmm. like, you know, agar tum ye film nahi hoti, Haan. actress or actress, to, to hmm. phir tum kya karti hai? Yani kya hoti hai abhi? Well, um, maine abhi abhi pura ek. Those are other bhi. habits. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, I, uh, main, main university se graduate hui. Right. Mm -hmm. 
Last year. Last year. Last yes. year. Yeah, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so I am currently an e-learning developer. Okay. With the federal government, so my, um, you know, I create e-learning courses for training purposes. Okay. Jabi, you know, logo jate, nay nay employees, agar business me jate, to fair orientation ke liye wo computer made course, you know. Yeah. Dena right. So that's very very in interesting. Yeah. Because it's um, it's combining again teaching or inspiring, mm -hmm. which acting gives me, mm -hmm. and it's creative. It is really really creative. Yeah. Understanding how people learn and th there's there's so many similarities between acting and the, yeah. and you know e-learning. So that's what I've been doing is just yeah. creating orientation courses for the federal government right now. So that's basically your full-time job at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. At the moment, but साथ साथ आप अपने passion को भी continue करते हो, like uh, the Jan Semi School you were talking about before the show. Yeah. <laughs> so why won't you actually tell us about that? Like, uh, what is that about? Okay, so um, thank you for asking. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, I, you know, I started teaching dance at different daycares across Calgary. So okay. Bright paths, you know, बहुत सारे bright paths के साथ में yoga पढ़ाती थी और dancing. And then this year, I decided to create my own. Okay. So it's called Rohini Performing Arts. Nice. The reason is, is because Rohini ka matlab hai star. So the, my intention, um, meri umid hai ke main Rohini Performing Arts, main dance sekhate, main yoga sekhate. So har log ke under which jo starlight hai, mm -hmm. you know, to ignite it, to so ignite to ignite the starlight in each person. Yeah, that's so that's amazing. that's the main mission of Rohini Performing Arts. Yeah, but I will cut it. And friends, I will tell you this. By the end of this show, I am Rohini and Jalal Bhai are going to make a new language. Yeah. <laughs> I know Punjabi and English. It's it's a mixture of everything. That's why then we will say that we are doing it, and they will say that we are doing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It will be very funny. That's mm. that's amazing. Like Rohini, one yeah. thing is that like, I have seen you as a performer, I have seen you as an actor, I have seen you as a model, I have seen you as a professional, bhi dekha hai, right? <laughs> In things to manage, karna, it's difficult. Yeah. How do you actually find time? Um, yeah, that's actually... You know, because I, I'm, I'm pretty sure, <laughs> like right now, a lot of people, when this show will be telecasting, right, a lot of youngsters are going to watch this program. And they like to know what is the mm -hmm. funda of what Rohini, <laughs> Rohini saying how you actually do or what is the mantra, you know, oh how how you actually do that. You know, it's it's a very good question. I think I think this year, mm -hmm. I actually felt that I was slowing down. Mm -hmm. Um, I felt like my energy was low, and and you know, it it just happens. Like life is like up, up and down, and down. Yeah. up and down, up mm -hmm. and down. But I think what keeps me going is. Just a balance. Like I, I cannot, I, <laughs> I cannot just focus on one thing. Mm -hmm. I have to have that balance, and I think university helped. Joe, yeah. sabi university loke. I think you can agree with me that university trains you to, all right, look after your health, go to the gym, mm -hmm. go to classes, right, and then after school join a club or, you know, do do something, yeah, get a job, and you learn to. Allocate your time based on different areas of your life. Mm -hmm. So um, I won't. I'm not gonna lie. I think this year I think I actually slowed down a little bit. But the good thing is that my professional job, I'm a contractor, so that mm -hmm. allows me a lot of flex flexibility. Time okay. in between, so you can. Spend, so yeah. I can go to an audition, or I can go teach at different schools, right. um, and I can do it at my own time. And that's something that I really like. It's mm -hmm. I, I like being my own boss. <laughs> so Rohini, uh, mm. you actually talked about like uh, work-life balance. Huh. Nowadays it is very important because I, Jalal Bhai, we also work full-time. Mm, yeah. But uh, we actually do this media work because we are very much passionate about this. And the good part is that our jobs actually gives us like that flexibility. Mm. So that's very good. So nowadays like youngsters or like professionals are actually looking for those kind of roles in the job market where they can actually uh, manage or create this balance in their life, mm -hmm. right? So you actually said like few things about this 
uh, this balance. That's how you can create it. Is there any other thing you can actually like to share uh, with our youngsters or our professionals, actually? Uh, do you have anything else? Because it is very important, like nowadays, like mm -hmm. to manage and balance your life. Yes. Otherwise, it is very stressful out there. I know exactly what you said about, mm -hmm. you know, you do this because you're passionate as well. So I think you touched on something mm -hmm. very important is um, you need to be passionate about yeah. what you do. So mm -hmm. there were some times when I guess so much dancing made me left, you know, made me tired or made me stressed out. So mm -hmm. when you hit that point, then yeah. you know that, OK, maybe I need to slow down a little bit and do something for yourself, you know try something new or relax relaxation is very 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 important yeah. <laughs> yeah. so um no i know i know that i know that a lot of places they talk about mindfulness and yoga mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and i think you know i think sometimes people get scared or they're mm. like oh god i don't want to do this for 15 minutes and i'm also guilty of it i mm -hmm. cannot you know stay and meditate for 10 minutes or 15 minutes but what I do is take time for myself. Mm -hmm. So that's in the morning <laughs> and night. Yeah. And I just 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 stay with myself. Yeah. And um, just think about nothing and just sit or lie down. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. No, 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 TV. no TV. So relaxation is number one. And then I think that there's so many different opportunities now. Like, you know, when you a lot of there's a lot of entrepreneurial spirit mm -hmm. that's happening a lot of jobs that can you know that you can go into which allows for your own hours or your own mm. flexibility and yeah. I know some of my friends who are also film directors film producers um, there's one of my friends Bavesh he's mm -hmm. he's rendering film you know producer and he he you know shoots videos edits videos and he also has a full-time job so yeah. I think it's just, I think it's just prioritizing, and yeah. mm -hmm. you know there there are different jobs available. Mm -hmm. Even in the corporate industry, I mean, okay, luckily I got this contractor role, mm -hmm. um, but you know, a lot, right now when you have the energy, I think when we're young and you have we have mm -hmm. the energy, you might yeah. as well take advantage of the fact that you mm -hmm. can do contractor roles or consultant roles or just do three different jobs at once and then as, as you get older you yourself will figure out okay what do I really want to do or what do I yeah. what do I want to focus in and then you can get you know a stable job some of my um, some of my actually co-workers and they told me that you know when you when, when you know what you want mm -hmm. like for some people it's different some people want you know a husband and a family or a wife and family and kids mm -hmm. and for that you know, for that choice, then a stable job, I think, is great. Mm -hmm. Plus, on the side, you can do whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Are um, you implying something? If I <laughs> 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 no, I'm just thinking, but there's so many different, yes. there's so many different Absolutely. ways to do it. That's, that's very true. Sorry, yeah, you know, like, of course, you, know, you can do so many things in your life now. You know, yeah. like you said, there are so many things you can do, of course, like, you can do acting, or you can teach dance, or you mm -hmm. can do dance, Same or you can do YouTube. other programs, <laughs> events. But you know, like like to manage this, this is mm -hmm. like you know you have to learn this. You know how to Absolutely. manage everything. Yeah. Otherwise, you won't be <laughs> like you won't be anywhere. So, how do you manage it? I know you. Of course, there are so many things. You have any schedule kind of thing, oh, or the one you can <laughs> share with our <laughs> viewers? <laughs> yeah, but you know what? Because you have to write. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, which you see, like you know, uh, yeah. like you know, you were coming here, so of course you already now yes. have to be there for. Okay. Uh, you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So the how can you tell or like uh, what can you tell to our viewers how to manage all these? Mm -hmm. oh, that's so sweet. Thank you, first of all. No, no, we're just like this. You're masala. Masala. Well, I think every artist is yeah. very, very like, like you're very creative. Creative. Yeah. yeah. Oh, um. So I do. I do, you know, consciously, you know, put the effort mm. in being organized. So that means I use my calendar on my phone always. Mm. And then I just, yeah, set events. I do sometimes, mm -hmm. I don't really plan for, you know, lunch or dinner. And that's mm. something that I also need to, you know, um, improve Get on. Better, yeah. Because <laughs> it is very important to schedule Absolutely. your lunch times or, you know, yeah. and I, there's so many things that I need to improve on. For example, okay, every week, 
make your lunches or mm -hmm. make your dinners and then take it. Mm, did you bring yeah. anything today? No. <laughs> <laughs> See, I need to listen to my own advice. Like, I mean, yeah, those are some things that would help. Right. Calendar, um, reminders, um, meal prep. I think for those who work out as well, I know that mm -hmm. you know it's very, very, very important. Absolutely. Um, I do schedule in a workout, so even if I have meetings or I'll either work out in the morning or, mm -hmm. you know, during my work we have a gym, so maybe just... Mm -hmm. Yeah, just go bit. there and work out. Or even at night. Yeah. And what else? Um, yeah, to be honest, I just use my calendar. Yeah, yeah. I go from there. Emails. Yes. Respond to emails as soon as I see them. Yeah. You know, like, this is a very good point. Like, uh, nowadays, because Facebook and... Uh, social media <laughs> has actually made our life really hell <laughs> in certain circumstances. Um, the thing is that like people are actually so addicted mm -hmm. that they have to respond to every single message. Yeah. Like they actually put themselves into that kind of a situation. So like uh, mm -hmm. I think like uh, I'm actually following and it actually helped me a lot. Okay. I have email and social media breaks throughout the day. So basically, like about two breaks, like morning me jab mene like nikal uh, se. At that time, I actually check and afternoon me, mm -hmm. uh, during like uh, before lunch. Mm -hmm. That's it, right? And if it is urgent, they can call me or something like that. It is very important. Right now, agar aap is tarah ke breaks nahi banaoge, jaise schedule nahi banaoge, it's difficult to focus on yourself. Ek chiz Rohini jo tumne like pehle thei ki like sit down. Just sit down <laughs> at the end of the day or at the beginning of the day. Because I personally, myself, I actually wake up very early, like mm -hmm. about 5 a.m. in the morning. And I sit down and I write journal. Oh, so journal cool. is very important for me, yeah. right? Because it actually helps me, like, uh, prioritize that this is necessary, this is not necessary, this is next week. So, I went to a conference, and in that conference, mm -hmm. in specifically, uh, SVP, uh, department ka tha, usne ka tha, ke I'm not the kind of a person like I'm long term planning. I'm yeah. every week ki planning. Mm -hmm. Because if your weeks are actually uh, intact, yes. right, and if you are achieving every week your plan, right, yearly plan up achieve. Kar <laughs> so, like, that's very important. Like, planning is very important. Doesn't matter, like, kisi bhi profession mein aap ho. it is very important to schedule, to write it down, uh, journal. Karo, Right? Schedule karo. Mm -hmm. Or have a time to relax. That's very important. Because workout is very important. Hai. Yes. I think like uh, <laughs> exercise or like up to the gym, mein ja ke thoda sweat, you know, <laughs> it's very important. So, Rani, do you, like, like, do you remember your first time in front of camera? How was it? How much confused were you? <laughs> Okay, first time. Because we both remember. Our <laughs> 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 yeah, son, well, uh, when we came, uh, yeah, we actually faced yeah, the camera. You, you tell us, you tell, tell me yours. No, when we have our interview, I will tell them. <laughs> oh God, okay. Um, I think it was the very first time was in an acting course mm -hmm. that I did. Okay. okay. So how it worked was you know, we, we go through a scene, mm -hmm. a partner and I, and our teacher's watching. Mm -hmm. And then we go through the scene in front of the camera, and it's all about the eyes. It's all about what the eyes are saying. Yeah, what eyes <laughs> are saying. So, um, yeah, for me, I was very, very, very shy. I just, I didn't want to see my <laughs> video after. And that's actually a lot of actors. A lot of actors don't. Yeah. So we got the real, we got the, um, videos in our Dropbox at the end mm -hmm. of each class and I think I, my friends honestly looked at them. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, my friends looked at them and then, yeah. And they said it was good? And it was like, they were good or Joby Kahe, I was like, okay, and then I'll watch it by myself. <laughs> but it took me a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, always like uh, for any profession, I think it, it takes a time. It requires yeah, some time. Requires because you might have a test, you know, today in our last three segments, so you never know. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, Rohini, like, I want to actually ask you about, like, your performing arts school. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, like, can you actually tell us a little bit more about that? Like, uh, mm -hmm. how does it work and uh, what is the idea behind it? Um, yeah, so, 
So I guess the idea is to combine whatever I have learned and whatever, you know, mm -hmm. I feel would be beneficial for kids ranging from five years up to adults. Mm -hmm. So, you know, like I combined yoga classes that I've taken, um, meditation classes that I've taken, mm -hmm my own experience as a performer, as a dancer, mm -hmm. as an actor. Mm -hmm. And my main intention is to, you know, really help people who think that, oh no, my my dance sneakers like do I can't dance or mm -hmm. um, you know, people children who have ADHD and there's so many children that I worked with at different C B U schools. Mm -hmm. My main intention is to get them to move mm -hmm. and to not care whether I'm doing this move correctly or you know this move correctly mm -hmm. so my uh, my intention is not to make the perfect and not perfect. to make them perfect yeah. it's yeah. just basically to get the confidence to get the um to to get everybody included yeah so the way i started the, i you know what again going through this it was a process because first mm -hmm. i started at daycares mm -hmm. so teaching yoga and dance in a daycare in daycares yeah. huh chote chote do salsa yeah very so cute. <laughs> we do face yoga, like uh, and the cute kids looking at you. It's, it's very sweet. But what I did was meditation, and that okay. worked. That worked with all ages, um, young to adults. Nice. So I think um, so. This year, I really formalized my intention, which was to work with students in school settings mm -hmm. and um, really make everybody feel included, whether you know, people, children have ADHD or whether they have difficulty moving a certain type of body. Mm -hmm. um, I think that's very, very, very important. Yeah. The music also um, right. excites people. Right. And okay, let's say me, Edward, and Salma will come yeah. to your school. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, how are yes. you going to start? You know, you know like, <laughs> yes. of course, the pro, you know, like, like a, so you know, for, <laughs> let's see, uh, like, yeah, for our viewers, you mm -hmm. know, if some, like, like someone, me, like, and, you know, Benji, Edward, Benji. and Salma, okay, then, it, so then, you know, what's your, what's your first step? Okay, so I did have some people who had absolutely no experience dancing. And no, I do experience. Yeah, okay. there we go. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we play Dandia. We play Dandia. Obviously, <laughs> obviously, obviously. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> the way I would do, I would do a little yeah. warm up, you know, watch you guys through the mirrors, see how you guys are, <laughs> okay. see if you guys can catch up. Uh, so, do you have a camera in the bathroom? <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm mirrors. <laughs> studio, I'm mirrors, studio, okay. yeah. And then, um, yeah, so warm up, I try to mix in fitness, mm -hmm. so fun and fitness. Yeah. And then also, I will correct you because, again, like, you know, I need to understand your learning goals, whether mm -hmm. you want to be corrected, whether you want to be perfected, or whether you're just doing this for fun yeah, and for yeah. fitness. Yeah, yeah, so, sure. um, recently I taught, you know, young adults, and for them, of course, I did correct, you know, the classical poses, and they wanted to learn, they wanted to perfect it. Yeah. So the performances that I was doing, mm -hmm. I was teaching them, and these are, you know, just new, new to Indian dancing. Yeah, like, yeah, but like, if you are a teacher, so we will learn. We will learn. No, 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 I'll, I'll be, I'm pretty strict <laughs> okay. when I need to be. Those are the things that our conversation is liking. So Rahini, like uh, you were talking about your school, mm -hmm. um, so like is it like any um, any place like you have, or you are actually visiting other places like to uh, teach them the dancing? Um, so I started off as te teaching in different CBU schools, okay. so elementary schools, junior high, high schools. Okay. And then I do, I did, sorry, <laughs> okay. teach a adults class in the northeast mm -hmm. and then I teach kids at my place in the northwest okay so for this upcoming year um, I will have a schedule out nice. and mm -hmm. uh, but the schools will still be there schools so if teaching anybody, at different schools so if anybody wants to actually contact you to attend oh, a school yeah. like uh, is there any website or anything like that I'm glad you asked that's the new goal <laughs> <laughs> okay that's the new goal for 2017 oh. um, but uh, yes, so you can reach me at Rohini Singh on Facebook or okay. Rohini K Singh, which is my entertainer page. Mm -hmm. And um, from there on, I can provide you information and there will be a website coming up. That's okay. True. Wonderful. So, Achara Rohini, you know, there was a movie last year came, Sun Oh, yeah? And <laughs> you were in it. <laughs> and we are so honored you are here today. No, it's so <laughs> one sweet. of the Bollywood, oh one of the Bollywood <laughs> actresses here. 
तो वो क्या हो रहा है सो सो द हाउ डू एवरीथिंग स्टार्ट फॉर द सनम रे ओह माय गॉश ओके दैट सो दोस्तों आपको बता दे चले कि सनम रे के अंदर रोहिणी ने रोहिणी का एक बहुत अच्छा रोल था और इन्होंने सनम रे वाज द मूवी रिलीज्ड लास्ट ईयर लास्ट ईयर लास्ट ईयर एंड और हमारे लिए और एक प्राइड की बात है कि वो यहां पे कनाडा में शूट हुई थी कैलगरी में बैफ के अंदर शूट हुई थी तो प्लीज रोहिणी हाउ दिस थिंग एक्चुअली केम अप या यू आई एम आई एम ग्लैड यू वाचड एंड थैंक यू बट थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग इट या या यू नो एक्चुअली दिस इज माय 10th टाइम हम लोग ने बस सिर्फ तुम्हारे लिए मूवी देखी थी यस आई वी वेरी ऑनेस्ट यस हम लोग ने मूवी इतनी अच्छी नहीं लगी लेकिन तुम्हारा रोल बहुत अच्छा लगा थी इट वाज रियली गुड या um yeah so again i actually one of my friends thank you to amir javed and omer javed if you guys are watching this thank you for telling me about an audition so an audition, the, yeah okay. there was i had to submit my resume cover letter audition tape so mm-hmm. i did all of that and then i got it so that was nice <laughs> <laughs> amazing and, and then um on the set it was It was great. It was great. One of my friends knew Pocket Samrat. So he kind of told yeah. me he's like, "You know what? Don't worry. Don't worry. You'll be okay." And you know, talk and then the production team was so nice. Mm. I I I'm still friends with a couple of them. Nice. That's amazing. So, um but you know what? The actual the actual shoot was very very funny. And I I um I acted with my friend Isha and she owns Designers Den Vesey mm-hmm. in Calgary. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's very nice seeing her on set. Um but during the shot Pulkit Samrat and I just improvised. <laughs> mm. I mean whereas in English movies there's a script and you have to follow it word by word. Right. Yeah. And in Bollywood films I guess you know there's a thorough the outline. But when you're on set, anything can happen. And <laughs> thank They God. They can change at the moment. Yeah. Wow. So Pulka did a phenomenal job, obviously, of yeah, doing absolutely. his role really well. And I just, res- you know, we were we were we were um, acting basically. We were reading each other's emotions uh, and yeah. going from there. So it was a really good experience. So then, what was the comments from the hero and heroine? Like, what did you? <laughs> Did you talk to them? Like the main actor? <laughs> no, I um Abadvich like after the shoot. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. After the movie, I just heard from my other friend that, right. you know, mm-hmm. it's all nice. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> no, that's, that's awesome. amazing. I think like uh, your all your hard works actually paid off like uh, at that time and you actually That was the first Bollywood movie? Yes, that was okay. the first. Okay. Any future plans? <laughs> oh my gosh, you know, I I don't know. I whatever comes this way. Mm-hmm. Um recently I did a music video with you know director Pramod Sharma Rana and he's worked in mm-hmm. Bollywood and in Punjabi films mm-hmm. um and I worked with him and our Calgary singer Jarnail Elan right. okay so he's been in India for the past few years and now he's also come back so that's mm-hmm. my I guess yeah. second interest <laughs> yeah. so you know like like uh, you know uh, you know our pal like, Sunny Singh you know him Sunny Singh yeah yeah so he was on our show as you know gold medalist then after that he got to the you know a uh, new english movie mm-hmm. so everything starts from here yes, so, so now you are here <laughs> inshallah you so you will move up like in fact how many bhul jana no of course not <laughs> no thank you oh my god like, no, so, you know I'm what's your so, you know let's say abhi jaise tumko movie mil gayi mm-hmm. or you know let's say if they ask you to to move to india would you yeah. do that um Yeah, well, I mean like if I get a role, yeah. then I would obviously consider it mm. and you know, with with my job flexibility, hopefully mm-hmm. we'll make that work. Awesome. That's great. No, no, <laughs> like uh, hopefully, hopefully it will work out. But yeah. you know, you have to like the script. Like you have to Yeah, um, the script has to. You have to read it. You have to like it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah don't you like Ranbir Singh? No. <laughs> <laughs> Or Ranbir Kapoor, sorry. Okay. <laughs> 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 so like uh really like you talked about Bollywood and Hollywood right a little bit you just little touched bit. it right <laughs> so uh you actually did you have a flavor for both of them right you actually acted in a short film as well oh yes yeah so yes. like can you actually talk about that project as well okay um yeah so yeah i mean acted in a short film which was last year last and that year. was about women empowerment and the different roles that a woman has in their lives so mm-hmm. whether you're I was playing an intern I was you know working in a company and so young and I had my boss and my other coworkers and you know a lady was pregnant so 
it was a really nice artistic movie about women insecurities and how you get oh, how you get past them. Mm -hmm. And then I also did a short movie where I was a psychiatrist. Mm -hmm. And you know, like I pick movies based on their message. And if something mm -hmm. appeals to me, then yeah. I'm really excited about it. Mm -hmm. Recently, actually, recently, um, we did this pilot about bullying. And it's beautifully written. The short movie is beautifully written by actually um, a director from Western Canada. He's he's released a feature film. Ali was screaming. I don't know if you've, it was released last year. Mm -hmm. So nice. he's directing this movie, and it's about it's about cyberbullying, oh. bullying in real life. How social media really affects. Um, it's a very people. interesting topic. Yes, yes. Yeah. yeah, so the again, I liked the topic and I liked how the script was written. So we'll see how that goes. Oh, that's that's cool. amazing. <laughs> so like, it feels like like you're enjoying like what is actually going on in your life at the moment yeah. and looking forward like for future projects as well. Mm -hmm. um, I would ask you like uh, three things. Okay. Like you would actually. Um, recommend our audience, like uh, the youngsters, the professionals, and everybody who is actually out there. And uh, what you would actually recommend them that they should follow in order to uh, fulfill their dreams? Oh my! <laughs> you know, just three things. Just three things. Not the entire <laughs> philosophy. <laughs> I'm asking. <laughs> yeah, you can add the Salam Namaste Canada too. Yeah, Salam Namaste Canada. Please. Please have <laughs> be friends please with come them. Be friends with them. There. No, but you know. Okay. Well. I mean, you're you're asking a psychology student. I analyze everything. Oh, here we go. <laughs> no, but I, I, you know, I'm not gonna lie. Like this year was definitely one of my lowest years. Mm -hmm. And um, I did a lot of analyzing, a lot of thinking. I think everyone goes through that at some point in their lives, mm -hmm. many times actually. But um, I just graduated from high, from sorry, from university. And now it's like, oh my gosh, again, the questions that probably a lot of people are having, mm -hmm. what should I do? Should I go all in into one or go all into another? And I think, number one, get your education. Yes, that's very important. That is very, because yeah. my family, my family background, they're all in the education line. And I think I kind of wanted to rebel a little bit and, <laughs> you know, but as I'm interacting with people, even in this industry or anywhere, like having that education really helps you have yeah. a strong foundation in just how you see yourself, mm -hmm. how you can understand different situations, how you understand people. Mm, that's true. You'll have you'll you'll understand. Hey, can I trust that person? Hey, does this seem mm. right? Does this align with what I want? Mm -hmm. So education is a must. Number two, um, I think you know really be really be grateful. <laughs> because, yeah, it's very important. Yeah. Yeah, because. I mean, I'm talking, but we are in Canada, mm -hmm. and I used to live in India. So I did grade one to grade six in India, and it was, you know, really repressed kind of life, you mm -hmm. know, freedom and and anything. And mm -hmm. there are so many opportunities here. Yeah. So definitely, like, we are so grateful to be in Canada. There are opportunities. It's all about you finding them. And I think it's very easy for us to be like, oh, you know what, this didn't happen to me, or. I can't find this, and I did that this year too. Mm. I was falling into that trap, and then I was just like, wait, no, there are so many opportunities. You just need to mm -hmm. go find them. That's if you want them. Yeah. Number three, your family yeah. and your friends. Of course, that's right. I, uh, I feel like when you're doing all of this, it's so easy to be like, oh, let me just go out with my friends and forget my family, but I think your family, or whoever you consider your family, mm -hmm. they are very, very, very mm -hmm. important. So, you know, like, you know, I'm going to ask you one more, you know, just to get related to this. What do you want them to remember about Rohini Se? Oh! <laughs> one, like, you know, one sentence. Well, I hope I helped ignite your starlight. Oh, oh amazing. <laughs> That's awesome. That's great. Rohini, like, uh, it's a pleasure to have you, like, on the show. Thank um, you for having me so sweetly. <laughs> Thank you very much for coming to our show and like uh, we wish you all the best in whatever you do in the mm -hmm. future and may all your dreams come fulfilled. Yeah. So, <laughs> Thank you, you keep us in a loop. Of course I will. I will. Friends, we all want to Merry Christmas. 
और हैप्पी हॉलीडेज विश करना चाहते हैं प्लीज़ इस हॉलीडे सीज़न पे अपने फैमिलीज के साथ बहुत अच्छा टाइम स्पेंड कीजिए हमारी विश है फ्रॉम सलाम नमस्ते कनाडा की टीम से और चकदे टीवी की जानब से हम चाहते हैं आपको विश करें हैप्पी हॉलीडेज थैंक यू